Tempest, we're going in after the Archon. I'll relay the layout to anyone following. Whoa, energy spike. The Archon is doing something in there. Standing by. Sarah may need attention. gets control and blows up worlds. Then we end him. It's all Meridian. It's massive. How many worlds could link through here? Assembling mathematical profiles. 
Keep it tight, people. We need to let Ryder work. Those pillars don't seem structural. Is this all Meridian? <laughs> so it's big, and controls the galaxy. We can still take it with guns. secure. Pathfinder, multiple system failures on the Hyperion. Damn it. Done. Done. Is there anything we can do? Stay out of our way. There's no pulling up. This is the captain. I need everyone to cry out. Go. Go. Go! I'm rerouting power to all medbay inertials. I can give us one shot. Attempting to shield the bridge with biotics, but I can't get close enough. The sleepers take priority. All hands brace. And it's been an honor to serve. No! Captain Dunn! The cryopods are intact. She brought it down. But there is no signal from the bridge. Everyone listening? That landing means humanity's staying long term. Anyone disagrees? We send them to the captain. No argument, Ryder. You have our support. Pathfinder, it's your honor to take that response to the Archon. First chat of the high period. Make them pay! Break them! Your method is grounded, Pathfinder. Collection and consultation is now that much easier. And not you. You will never have our distance. I'll not you. 
Matrix. The Archon, does he know he's broadcasting? He's in Sarah's head. We're connected. Remnant, but not attacking. The hell? It's pointing, guiding us. That can't be the Archon. Everyone see that? Doors closing? Someone's hurting us. The Archon, maybe. Who else would it be? More doors. Maybe. Sarah's found a way to help. Ryder, using Remnant hurts you. Prepare to repeat the cortical stimulus. Get out of my head! You are irrelevant. I will use your connection. God damn it! Path, Sarah. 
He was distracted, like the sound of his own voice. So determined, but so pointless. Your connection serves me. I know how it works. The mind is trained to think like the remnant creators. In this case, painfully. But I'm content to let her bear that burden. Whatever gives me Meridian, I will transcend what you pretend to be. You're out of time. I've matched you every step. You failed, Archon. You're the pretender. You learn by accident. I am the genetic inheritor of a thousand species. No more mercy. Kill them all. Sarah's implant. Can they survive drawing this much power? I only care about one of them. I know it hurts, but you have to call out where to interface. Get me targets. Everyone get that? We're shutting the Archon down. Zero where to? <sighs> Nav marked for one of his main power draws. Get there. I'll try to expose it so you can interface. Hurry! Now. 
already surpassed you. You're pathetic. Fractured the Archon's attention. Hold position, kill Remnant. I'm on it. Sam? Weakness? The armored head, Sarah. Shield's open, fucker. You pushed There's too far. Now you'll pay.
it up. Relays ahead. Exalted countless species. Hit them all on the way, no stopping. I'm in range, expose the relay. I'm trying. Hi. We've almost got it. Don't give up. I'm not done yet. Hold there. Do you think you're having all the fun? We're here to kick his tail, Pathfinder. Sarah! Sarah! 
We are out of time, Pathfinder. Hurry. This is not the end. I have the network. Don't do anything stupid. We're live. Sam's broadcasting to everyone. Never knew you were such an attention hog. Going off, saving the galaxy all by yourself. I may have been a focus, but all of Helios came together. This moment belongs to everyone. Hey, Sarah. I'm getting too used to this. How long? Weeks. Relax. You haven't missed much. The Ark and the Sleepers, they're safe in the Sphere? There's no raising the Hyperion, but we're not done with it. It is Meridian. A new port for all of humanity. We did it, Dad. What about your implant and Sam? I am once again helping the Pathfinder activate Remnant. 
Our connection has been restored to normal. Normal? You need him again? I need Sam to make it easier. I was adapting, but damage was being done. We need to be careful, Sarah. The Nexus leaders are waiting, Pathfinder. Duty calls. Better not keep them waiting. It never ends. Go on. I need some rest. The decision isn't yours. Neither is it yours. That is the point, isn't it? Pathfinder, you're late. All right, get to it. What's so important? Initiative protocol. Thanks to you, we can finally proceed as intended. As outposts become colonies, the cluster needs its own voice. A true council. And while I maintain that it is premature, we must nominate an interim ambassador to represent concerns outside the Nexus. Or rather, you must nominate someone. If this person is supposed to represent people, shouldn't the people have a say? That is precisely why we need your backing. We can't impose a vote on the Angar. Or even Kadara. Eladin? <laughs> Won't happen. But you've acted for everyone. If you endorse a name, some may disagree, but they will trust it as a starting point. Someone to speak for Helios. I put forward Pathfinder Hager. I'd suggest you, but someone might think you killed the Archon to elevate yourself. We can't allow the appearance of that. But Hager keeps the position, and the timeline, in the Nexus family. The Angara need to help define the process. It's their right. Plus, the Moshai would help solidify relations. They have ongoing civil concerns with the Rokar. Ugh, and we've a lot of unresolved issues of our own. It feels like the original intent was to give that voice to the outposts. August Bradley's a proven leader. On a considerably smaller scale. He's kept Eos relatively stable, despite no militia presence. Meridian doesn't mean done. Cat are still out there. A Pathfinder is the obvious choice for stability. For us. But hardly the empowering one. Same old bullshit. This representative should be one of the people actually doing the work. First outpost, first ambassador. Bradley's my choice. Safe enough. Nothing disruptive from Meridian's opening day. Something by the book for once. Sarah is feeling better. Good. This decision, the policy and protocol, that's not what your victory was about. There's more to life than this. Up straight, everyone. This is the guest of honor. Well, like you have to tell anyone that. Hunter, this is our opening. Let there be some sense of ceremony. As I was about to say, hello, Pathfinder. I am Chief of Operations, Ayora Pile. Second Wave Placements Officer, Darlavas Hyperion. Hunter Carey, Reconstruction. Sounds like Meridian is in good hands. I can only read the reports of how you brought us this opportunity. But rest assured, we will not waste it. Yes. Thank you, Pathfinder. Aye, what they said. We got a lot wrong on this trip. But they were right about Pathfinder. Arc Hyperion. Departed Milky Way 2185. Arrived Andromeda 2819. Current status recorded as Meridian. Well, narrator guy is getting work. Please select a topic.
Thank you, Pathfinder. You're why we're here. Hey, Ryder. How's Sarah? Much better. There might be two Riders around soon. Imagine. The Hyperion's forming scientific teams. Gotta start studying what we have. I may have helped them organize. It's what you do. Meridian won't know what hit it. And we should think about what's next. This is a new cradle for humanity. That's a big idea. Bigger than I'd imagined. So maybe building those teams was smart. Small steps to understand all this. Until we're at the top of the mountain. And seeing the next horizon. Can't deny it. I'm game for more. With so much power in our hands, you think it'll be okay? Cora, sometimes you just have to leap out there and see where it takes you. Yeah, I guess you do. Whatever happens, you gave everyone an incredible gift. Nice job, Pathfinder. <laughs> so this is how you all party, hmm? <laughs> Pretty tame, but don't tell the host I said that. Meridian is amazing, though. You... Accomplished the inconceivable. I'm grateful to be part of it. No, I'm grateful. I couldn't have asked for a better team. We created this together. And exactly what it is, what it may become, <laughs> I can't even imagine. To think that when we met, the Angara and your initiative struggled to find trust. The way we arrived on Aya was over the top. You know, uninvited and on fire. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> Guess it worked out okay. <sighs> Ryder, the Angara will never forget how you saved the Moshrai. But more than that, we'll never forget how you fought the Ket beside us. How we destroyed the Archon. Meridian is a new beginning for your people and mine. Together. New beginnings. That's what I came to Helios for. And what I dreamed of. Yes. <laughs> new beginnings. So, let's get to it. Pathfinder, catch C for you in your planet. That's not getting less weird. About time Iridium got a proper grand opening. We all need this. Heard Sarah woke up. How's she doing? She'd be angry if I said anything but great. Which means, great. Stubborn as hell. I hear it runs in the family. Hey, know who I just talked to? A second wave technician, fresh out of cryo. Just had his first sunrise in Andromeda. He couldn't stop crying. Just him? <laughs> uh, must be something going around. Maybe you're the carrier. We're still outsiders to a lot of people. But this... It's almost home. They haven't given you five minutes alone since the fight. Have you had a chance to let it sink in? There's so much here. It'll be years before we even know where to start. Don't need starters. Starters are a dime a dozen. We need finishers. And we have the best. I'm looking at you, Pathfinder Rider. The whole galaxy is. Cheers. It's overwhelming. I don't know where to start. Rules quiet. So, Tan says he's gonna let me stick around and help with the... Hey, Ryder. What's the word on the street? Ryder saves the day. Pathfinder of the century. You know, the usual. Still? Get used to it. They're gonna name things after you when you die. And probably even before. So we heading out again soon? Oh, she's all grown up, leaving home, doesn't need me anymore. <laughs> That'll be the day. We'll handle my deals on this end while I'm gone. Seeing you two in cahoots <laughs> makes me all misty. You know this is your fault, right? Helping us along? Helis has really turned into the fresh start I wanted, in so many ways. And now with Meridian, we're really going to make this place ours. I can't wait. You know where to find me when you're ready. How's things?
firefighter, sir. So formal all of a sudden. Ha! <laughs> Gotta have some standards after what we did. This place is something else. We did it. Beat the Archon and took his toys. Feels good, doesn't it? I sent out the Nakmore scouts. Nearly drowned me in reports until I pointed them at Tan. Told him to be extra wordy just for him. He'll love that. He wanted the job, he can have the reports. It's not over, you know. There'll be more Ket and whatever else is waiting out there. Whatever happens, we'll be ready for it. Pathfinder and crew ready to take on the galaxy, huh? They won't know what hit them. Finder, here. Hi, Ryder. So glad you're up and around. I have important news for you. There always is. Yes, discoveries every day, but this is something we've been waiting for. Listen. What should I be hearing? Sorry, Sam. Active filtering. Initiative protocol Alpha Alpha to the screen. Protocol what? Processing. Repeating! This is the Ark Kiasia! The situation is not under control. Note and avoid until further update. Repeating! Is that? The Quarian Ark. And Elcor? Drell? Volus? Hanar, I think. That's some delicate business, putting Hanar in stasis. Point is, they're still out there. The Kiasia wasn't destroyed. It's patchy. And there's no traceable vector, I assume? It bounced through the Scourge. I've doubled long-range probes, but... That's not a distress call. It's a warning to keep away from... wherever they are. Whatever's happening, they don't want to be found yet. We have to trust their Pathfinder. All we can do is wait. Pool's quiet. Pathfinder, I'm told there will soon be a new voice representing Helios. Another of your leaders claiming to know what we need. It was an impossible choice, Ephra. There's no name that would represent everyone. Though the one chosen definitely represents someone. Don't they, Pathfinder? No one's pretending this is ideal, but it's a start. That's irrelevant. Things started long before any of you arrived. The only important question is, what will continue? Hire of GX's Pathfinder. To better tomorrows. It's overwhelming. Ready whenever. Ryder, enjoying the fruits of your labor? You deserve it. Thanks, Callow. The Tempest is getting some much needed service. I was underfoot, apparently. But I wouldn't miss the big day. Meridian looks so different out of the cockpit. I think I understand better why you do what you do. Thinking of trading in your pilot's chair for some muddy boots? Not even slightly. I know what I'm good for. I don't pretend to understand everything, but Meridian must have opened a lot of doors. Not all of them safe. I want you to know that it'll be my privilege to keep flying you to them. I can't do this without a good pilot. Or a great pilot. How about a pilot determined to help his friends? The Tempest will be pristine by the time you're ready to go. Just point the way, Pathfinder. Good.
you're here. Maybe the festivities can finally begin. I don't like sitting on my ass. Places to see, people to go, you know what I mean. Well, let's get this show on the road. Meridian looks great, but, you know, been there, done that. Hey, this was a big accomplishment. It's important to enjoy it. Don't get me wrong. I'm proud of us. Helios is changing, and will be for a long time. I'm just antsy. Don't want to miss a thing. There's so much more out there to learn and do. I know. We've only just scratched the surface. Hey, get your head out of the sky, Ryder. Enjoy the moment. We're here to celebrate, remember? I'm trying to do just that. I went too far? I did, right? Yeah, okay. For now, you're right. The galaxy isn't going anywhere. Let's have some fun. What does this mean, sir? The language is imprecise, or perhaps too precise, but the... Meridian, huh? I see it every day, and I'm still amazed. We're really starting to put down roots. It's wonderful. Did I tell you? The team's working with the Angara to set up a joint research body. That sounds exciting. I know. I can't wait. Us helping them, them helping us. Can you imagine what we could accomplish? <sighs> I'm getting all misty just thinking about it. Joint research body cooperation with the Angara? You're planning a party, right? Of course. Nothing builds a team like a good whiskey and a laugh. You'd better show up, Ryder. We wouldn't be here if not for you. <laughs> I wouldn't miss it for the world. Still standing? Still standing. Then I did my job. Somehow. Nothing more need be said. There's one thing. Dr. Lexi DePero, thank you. <laughs> yeah, that did it. You jerk. Go on. I have a reputation to protect. Look at this place. Hey, Ryder. Have to say, victory looks good on you. Even so, I wasn't smiling until you showed up. I have that effect on incredibly talented and dynamic people. So, this is supposed to be a celebration, right? You getting used to any of this yet? Meridian? The dream becoming a reality? It's a lot to take in. I'm still in the pinching myself phase. Well, I'm sure everyone here would be happy to line up and give you a pinch. But, so you know, I've got the Tempest topped out and ready. You want to blow this hot dog stand? Just say the word. Callow's out there somewhere, time one on. If we're really sneaky, he won't even notice we're gone. Who's flying then? You? Why the hell not? I'm a quick study. How hard can it be? Gil, do me a favor. Anything. Don't ever change. You like this outfit, huh? All right, I'll wear it forever. Honored to see you, Pathfinder. Glad to have you. A fantastic turn of fortune. Pathfinder. Perhaps one day the Parchero can expect the same. In not quite so dramatic a fashion, hopefully. Living so soon? I can't stop thinking of what I could be doing. How much is still out there? I feel the same. It's a strange type of hunger that changes galaxies. I'm new to this role myself. The training didn't cover how to honor your peers. There's no protocol. 
Your father invented this role, but you defined it. This is great and all, but it feels weird to be on a ship that isn't moving. We're explorers. There's more to see out there. Let's go find it. <laughs> 